welcome to e career plus channel in this video today we are going to see how to do soldering in keypad mobile phone today i am having geo mobile phone in keypad mobile phone the display may have 24 pins 32 pins or 40 pins so lots of varieties are there today i am going to teach you how to remove and fix the strip type display this practice not only will help you to remove and fix the display it also will help you to fix the camera which has strip type but also will help you to fix the camera which is in strip type here you can see this display strip has lots of pins all these pins will be soldered with the board lines now we can desolder these pins by using soldering machine or smd rework station using soldering machine also contains a little bit risk because when we are using soldering machine because of overheat the track line may disconnect if so it may require jumpering process but when you are using smd rework station with the accurate heat and air it will not affect the track line so today i am going to use smd rework station when you are removing the display it will be pasted in both corners so remove that first with the care next the strip also will be pasted you have to remove it carefully and gently now it's done next we can see how to apply the paste and desolder before that i'm going to fix this board in a pcb holder tight the board firmly soldering paste will prevent the track line and display strip from overheating now we can apply the soldering paste on a strip now we can start the desoldering process in smb rework station fix the air in two and heat can be from 300 to 350 hold the soldering station when you are heating the pins hold the smd rework station with a little bit distance don't hold it too closely it will melt and come out automatically till that we have to wait now you can see we have removed the display without any track line damage you can see that now we have to remove the excess lead from the board first we can clean with ipa solution next i am going to use desoldering wick to remove the excess lead when you are using desoldering wick do it upwards to downwards position don't take left to right use the wick from upwards to downwards position to remove the excess lead do not go with left to right because of sideways position the pins will short with one to another so don't do that now i have removed the excess lead from the board completely with the help of desoldering wick now again clean with the ip solution and wipe it well with the cloth now you can see the track lines just touch and see it has to be very smooth if not so you have to clean it again now i am going to apply the new lead on track lines gently apply the lead only on track line lead must be applied on pins individually it should not touch with one another it may cause short so while applying the lead do it carefully take a medium amount of lead and apply no need to take much now i have applied the lead completely just wipe it with a cloth after applying process next i am going to fix the display 
while fixing the display you have to be very careful with the position it should be in this position only the strip should be turned towards like this and has to be soldered to find out the exact position of the strip you can see the circle on a board and also you can see two holes on this strip these holes has to be on this circle if you don't fix this strip properly now hold this strip on a position now i'm going to apply the soldering lead holes has to be fixed on the circle if you didn't fix this strip properly the panel won't set hold the strip on a position and first do soldering on both corners and solder it once you done the soldering on corners it will be easy to you to complete the soldering process on other pins each and every individual pin must be soldered properly soldering process is not a just like thing you have to do it with the patience do it carefully now i have completed the soldering process you can see the board after soldering it mandatory that every individual pin must be soldered with the board individually then only the display will work when you are removing the problemed display from the board it's not a issue but while replacing a new one you have to be very careful with the soldering process now we can see this display after switch on now let's switch on this display it's working you can see that display is switched on now in some phones there will be a separate line for led you can see that here when we are desoldering the display strip at times the led line also be disconnected in this case the display will work but the led won't for this kind of complaint you can also solder the led line this is the process of removing and fixing the display thank you